physical properties of the electric current. Uses and importance of electricity. 1. Lightning, where electricity changes to heat energy. 2. Heating, heaters and irons where electricity changes to heat energy. 3. Radio and telephone, where electricity changes to sound energy. The atom consists of Nucleus, it is the center of the atom it contains, a positive proton, neutral neutron. Electrons, negative charge rotate around the nucleus, give reason, due to the attraction force between protons and electrons. When the attraction force is weak, the electrons will leave the atom, become free, and move in the wires, conductors, creating the electric current. Electric current, the flow of electric negative charges, electron, through a conductor. Physical properties of the electric current. 1. Current intensity. 2. Potential difference. 3. Electric resistance. Current intensity. The intensity of light isn't determined by the number of electrons, but by the rate of the flow of electrons through a specific point in the wire. The electric current intensity. It is the quantity of electric charges passing through cross section of the conductor in one second. Current intensity equals quantity of charges over time. I equals Q over T. It is measured by using a device called a meter that has a symbol A. A meter is connected in series. Measuring unit of the current intensity as ampere. The measuring unit of the quantity of electricity is coulomb. The measuring unit of the time is second. Ampere. The electric current intensity passing through a circuit when a charge of one column passes through a given cross section in one second. Coulomb, the charge transferred by constant current of one ampere in one second. The electric potential difference. The temperature moves from a hot object to a cold one and it continues to move until the two temperatures are equal. The movement of temperature does not depend on the size of the two objects, but on the difference in their temperatures. The temperature difference between two conductors determines the transfer of the heat energy to and from an object. If two charged conductors touch the electric current, will move from the high conductor to the low one until they become equal. The flow of charges does not depend on their amount, but on the conductor, potential difference in comparison to the other conductor. The difference of electric potential between two conductors determines the transfer of the electric charges to and from an object. Potential difference equal work joule over charged coulombs. V equals W over Q. A joule is the amount of work done by a force of one newton moving an object through a distance of one meter. Volt is the potential difference between two poles of a conductor on doing a work of one joule to transfer a quantity of electricity, one coulomb. The electric potential of a conductor. It is the condition of an electric conductor that shows the transfer of the electricity to and from it when it connected to another conductor. The electric potential difference of a conductor. It is the value of the work done to transfer a quantity of electric charge between the two ends of this conductor. The potential difference is measured by using voltmeter that has a symbol V. Voltmeter is connected in parallel connection to measure the electric potential difference. The measuring unit of the potential difference is volt. The measuring unit of the work is joule.
Electromotive force, EMF. EMF is the potential difference between the two poles of the battery when the electric circuit is open. No current passes. EMF is measured in volt. The voltmeter V to measure the potential difference and EMF. It connects in parallel between the two terminals of the conductor to measure the potential difference. It connects in parallel between the two poles of battery to measure the electromotive force when the circuit is open. The electric resistance. It is the opposition that the electric current faces during its movement in a conductor. It is measured by using instrument called an ohmmeter. The measuring unit of the electric resistance is ohm. The ohm is the resistance of the conductor that has an electric current of 1 ampere and when the potential difference between its poles is 1 volt. Types of electric resistance Constant, fixed resistance, variable, rheostats. The variable resistance, the sliding rheostat. It is a resistance which can change in order to control the current and potential difference in the different parts of the circuits. Its structure, metal wire of high resistance wrapped around the cylinder made of an insulating substance as porcelain. Thin copper rod with a thin plate slider is touching the wire and can slide on it for the whole length of the cylinder. Idea of operation. By sliding of the flexible sheet on the wire, you can control the length of the wire that enters the circuit and also the current passing through it. If we increase the length of the wire, the resistance increases and the current intensity decreases, vice versa. Ohm's Law To discover the relation between current intensity and potential difference. Steps 1. Connect an electric circuit consisting of a battery, variable resistant, rheostat, ammeter, connected in series, voltmeter, connected in parallel, and a key. 2. Switch on electric current to the circuit through key and observe the current intensity in the circuit. Reading of the ammeter in amperes. I. And the potential difference reading the voltmeter in volts, V. 3. Change the resistance by using the rheostat, therefore, the values of I and V will change. Record their values. 4. Repeat the above steps several times by changing the resistance each time. Find the values of I and V in each time. 5. Find the results of dividing V over I in each time. 1. Dividing V over I equals constant value. 2. The constant value equals the resistance and its symbol is R and its unit is ohm. 3. V over I equals R and this relationship is known as Ohm's law. Ohm's law. The electric current intensity passing through a conductor is directly proportional with the potential difference when the temperature is constant. Ohm. It is the resistance of a conductor which allows the electric current to pass its intensity in one ampere and the potential difference between its two terminals is one volt. Ampere, it is the current intensity passing through a conductor whose resistance is one ohm and the potential difference between its poles is one volt. Volt, it is the potential difference between the two poles of a conductor whose resistance is 1 ohm and its current intensity passing through it is 1 ampere. Resistance of a conductor is the ratio between the potential difference between the two ends of a conductor and the current intensity passing through it.